that's a nicer shot, isn't it? It's a better, better quality shot. They're the men under 100 kilos. It's tricky to um, to choose between the contests because they're really um, really warming up now. We've got Alexander Mikalin of Russia, uh, and he's up against Daniel Hernandez on mat two. I think Hernandez was in uh, Tokyo for that team championships as well. Okay. Because the brilliant Brazilians got the bronze medal. They yeah. beat out the Japanese in the first round. Yeah. So the crowd after that was dead. <laughs> yeah. There was no crowd. Luckily, the Japanese women. Yes, the women. Did, did, yeah. did you fight them? Yes. <laughs> what, was, what was that like? Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah? Yes. I concentrate on my fight. Yeah. <laughs> That was a good team. I can't remember who they beat in the final. Wasn't the Chinese, was uh, it? French. For the French. The French team. I think it was almost wipe wipe out, wasn't it? Uh, it wasn't that wasn't that good for the French. The Chinese sent a reasonable team, but not their number ones. Yeah. It's a good team, yeah. but uh, not their number ones. Who's the? There isn't a Chinese girl in the 63s that's really good you know I mean yes, like in yes. 52 48 and then yes. 70 70 under 78 and plus 78, 78 yes but for some reason 57 and 63 mm, there's, there's a little no bit of space there mm, yeah yeah and that's where they they didn't pick up medals in Beijing if I remember rightly you can have a quick look anyway it's just out of interest but uh, the 48, they didn't get one either. Yes. The little 48 kilo girl, she did. She didn't get a medal. 52 was the the then double Olympic champion yes. Shangdong Mei. Um. But yeah, just in the 57s and 63s, not as uh, not the kind of depth that yes. you see in the other weights. And your your mind, are you set now with a goal to what next? Where will you look for at the highest level of competitions? What are you looking to? I look for the World Championship. Okay, so we'll see you in Rotterdam. When is that decided? How will, when will we know who will um, go? I think uh, after the German Open in, Bra uh, in Sindelfing. The, okay, because it's normally in uh, Braunschweig. Yes, but this uh, year it's in Sindelfing. I like so Braunschweig. <laughs> Me too. It's closer to home, isn't it, for you? Yes, it's uh, far, uh, not far away. Yes. How do you how do you normally travel there? Do you go by train or car or car? Or, yeah, by car, car or by by bike. <laughs> you ride motorcycle. No. Uh, bike. 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 Yes. From where to where? Uh, in Halle. <laughs> <laughs> no, <come on. laughs> I mean, how do you go from Halle to Braunschweig? Uh, by, by car. <laughs> <laughs> you go by bike? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no wonder you're so fit. <laughs> that would be quite a, quite a trek. <laughs> some, okay. some hundreds of kilometers. <laughs> right, so we just found out that Claudia does not go by bike to Braunschweig <laughs> from Halle. It's um, by car. <laughs> but the the real question is um, Rotterdam and when uh, that decision will be made after Sindelfingen, yeah? Yes, I think. And in the, um, in the team, is it just... Uh, who else is in there? Because you've got three or four good girls in under 63 kilos. Yes. Apart from Claudia Aharins, who was here. Yes. Who else is... Um, Stefanie Steinmetz. Steinmetz, from yeah, we've seen Berlin. her before, yeah. Yes. And one other... Martina Dreidos from K it's she, she she's, she's young around yeah young, yeah but, good. <laughs> but it really is between you and uh, Claudia Ahrens and, then and uh, Franziska Pufal it's uh, the Pufal same as well. yeah, club yeah. Uh, like Claudia Ahrens yeah Pufal we've seen yes. fighting internationally but um, who just moved out of 63 and up to 70 who moved up somebody no. there was somebody in this category and they moved up. No? no? Okay. What's happened to... Um, has anybody retired recently? No. No? Oh, okay. 
Well, Correa is leading by Mazzari. No doubt these two know each other really well. Leonardo Lecce and Luciano Correa. Correa won the um, World Championships here in Rio in 2007. He lifted the roof off the uh, stadium by beating uh, Peter Cousins of Great Britain in that final. And I think the um, referee is looking to hand Sokumake later. How do you get to a grand slam and allow yourself those penalties to, to be Hans Sokumake? We saw it in a fight earlier on. Oh well, that's the second time we've seen um, somebody put out of the competition from penalties. I know the referees hate it. They don't like it. 